Good morning children. In this class of maths, we will learn multiplication of three digit numbers by two digit numbers. You can see here, it is written. We have to multiply a three digit number, for example, 424 by a two digit number, that is 23. We can start. This is our number. You can see 424 and 23. A three digit number and a two digit number. We write here 1010s and 1s. Now in the first step, what we will do? In the first step, we multiply 424 by 3 only. 3 for the 12, we write the digit of our right hand side here and we carry 1. 3 to the 6 and this 1, 7. 3 for the 12. First step is completed. Then the second step. In the second step, we multiply 424 by 2. How we multiply? We write here first, we write 0 here. Then 2 for the 8, 2 to the 4 and 2 for the 8. Then we add these numbers. 2 plus 0, 2. 7 plus 8, 15. We write 5 here and we carry 1. 2 plus 4, 5 and 1, 7, 8 plus 1, 9. This is the product, our answer. What's it? 7 is, you have to do, uh, later we have, we will do this. What's it? 7. First we see the word problems. In so many situations in our life, we have to multiply the numbers. You have to know that when you multiply. In which word problem you have to multiply and which in which situation we can understand it by examples first example in an orchard apple trees are planted in rows there are 35 rows in one 35 trees in one row number of trees in one row is given and you have to find the number of trees in 42 rows that is when the information information about one is given and you have to find out the information about more than one you will multiply in that cases so we write like this number of apple trees in one row is equal to 35 number of rows is equal to 42 total number of apple trees is equal to 35 into 42 we simply multiply these two numbers 2, 5 is a 10, we write a 0 and carry 1, 2, 3 is a 6 and 1, 7, 4, then the next step, we write a 0 first, then 4, 5 is a 20, we write here 0 and we carry 2, 4, 3 is a 12 and 2, 14, then we add the numbers 0, 7, 4 and 1, this is the total number of trees in that orchard. Similarly, in question number 1. One box contain 25 toffees, then 28 such boxes contain how many toffees? We write like this, number of toffees in one box is equal to 25, number of boxes is equal to 28, then number of 28 boxes is equal to 25 into 28, simply you will multiply 25, 28, 8 are 40, we write 0 here and we carry 4, 2 8 the 16 and 4. 20 then the next step we write here 0 first then 2 5 is a 10 we write 0 here and 2 to the 4 and 1 5 then after addition we get 700 this is the total number of toffees there are so many questions we will do it in the next phase then value based questions Radha and her family lives near an orphanage Every year on festival and birthdays, they all visit the orphanage to distribute sweets. Radha has made many friends there. This year, she has invited all 36 children of the orphanage for her birthday party. Radha decided to give them return gifts. For this, she bought pencil boxes costing Rs. 65 each. She celebrated her birthday happily. You can see in this very best question that Radha is living near an orphanage. You know what is orphanage. So Radha invite, 
invited 36 children of the orphanage for her birthday party and she gives them a gift worth rupees 65. She gave the gift to 36 children and one children get the gift worth rupees 65. Then the questions. One, how many money did Radha spend to buy return gifts for the children? How you can get the answer? You can simply multiply 36 to 65 because the value of one gift is 65 and the number of total children is 36. So you will multiply to find out the answer of question number 1. Suggest any two ways in which you can help the children of an orphanage. How you can help the children of orphanage? You can help in so many ways. You have to write here. Suggest some items which can be given as return gift without purchasing them. How you can give the return gift without purchasing them. Now we do the word problems and question of, uh, questions of worksheet 6. You can see here this is worksheet 6 of our mathematics book. We have to find the product. Suppose we have question number 1, 24 multiplied by 17. We have to multiply 24 by 17. How you can multiply? 7 for the 28. We write the digit of right hand side here and we carry 2. 7 to the 14 plus 2, 16. We write here. Then 1 for the, we write first 0 here. Then we start. 1 for the 4, 1 to the 2. Then we add the number 8 plus 0, 8. 6 plus 4, 10. We write 0 here and carry 1. 2 plus 1, 3 and 1, 4. Then the next number, question number 8. 60 and 35. 5 and 0. When they multiplied, uh, we get 0. 6, 5 is 30. Then we write 0 here first. 3 and 0 multiplied 0 3 6 18 then we add 0 plus 0 0 0 plus 0 0 8 and 3 11 we write here 1 and we carry 1 1 plus 1 2 we get 2100 as our product then box it 7 3 digit number multiplied by 2 digit number we have 235 and we have to multiply it by 28 8 5 is a 40. We write 0 here and carry 4. 8 3 is a 24 and 4. 28 we write 8 and we carry 2. 8 to the 16 and 2 18. Then we write 0 here. 2 5 is a 10. We write 0 here. Carry 1. 2 3 is a 6 and 1 7. 2 to the 4 and 1. Uh, this one is added. 2 to the 4. Then we add the number 0 plus 0 is 0, 8 plus 0 8, 8 and 7 15, we write 5 here and carry 1, 2 plus 4 6. In this question also, 205 and 23. 3 5 is a 15, we write 5 and 1 carry, 3 0 is a 0, we write 1, 3 to 6. 2 5 is a 10, we write 0, 2 0 is 0, 1, 2 to the 4. And then we add the numbers here. Then the word problems. In a book there are 117 pages and we have to find out the pages in 21 books. We write like this. Number of pages in one book is 117. Number of pages in 21 books is this. Then we multiply. Then question number 3. A necklace contains 108 beads. That means number of beads in one necklace is equal to 108. And we have to find out, find out the number of beads in 32 necklaces. We multiply this and this. In question number 4 also, there are 32 balloons in one packet. And we have to find out the number of balloons in 24 such packets. Number of balloons in one packet is equal to 32. Number of balloons in 24 packets is 32 multiplied by 24. We multiply 4 to the 8, 4 3 the 12. Then we write 0 here, 2 to the 4, 2 3 the 6, and we get 768 after addition. So there are 768 balloons in 24 packets. 
in a hall there are 35 rows of chairs so number of rows equal to 35 and number of chair in one row is equal to 15 so we write like this number of chairs in one row equal to 15 number of chairs in 35 rows equal to 15 into 35 we multiply the numbers 35 15 5 5 is 25 we write 5 here we carry 2 5 3 is 15 and 2 17 then we write 0 here 1 5 is 15 1 3 is 3 we write 5 then 12 we write 2 here 1 plus 3 5 525 in this way we have done we have solved word problems and multiplication of three digit number by two digit numbers you will do all the sums in your copies and books if the space is given in your book then you will do it in your books then if space is not given you will do it in copies thank you